Hi class, welcome to uh, week number seven of the semester. Sorry, this is a bit late with your update of what to do for the week. I've been having technical issues, um, really bad ones, especially trying to make sure the film that we're watching is available for you to stream on Blackboard. Uh, so real quick, just before we jump into what we need to do to complete this week, I just wanted to let everyone know that close responses one are graded. I'm working on close responses number two. If you have not turned in close response number one, uh, or even close response number two, either of them, please go ahead and do so. One quick thing to note is uh, the late work policy. Uh, in this class, there is no, there are no penalties for turning in late work. I would rather you turn in something whenever you can, as opposed to feeling you don't have the opportunity to turn in anything. So you can submit work late if you haven't done so. Also note, if we go on to our syllabus, which is what we're looking here, uh, at the end of the semester, students will have the opportunity to revise an assignment to improve the grade. So you will have uh, an opportunity to choose one assignment to revise to improve the grade at the end of the semester. It's something to keep in mind as you are getting your grades back uh, throughout this, this term. Do note that this late work policy only works for major assignments. It doesn't really count writing quizzes or discussion boards. So real quick, what are we doing this week uh, of the semester? We are starting our new unit. Uh, this unit is centered around the movie Children of Men. If you have not seen this movie, it's available for you to watch on Blackboard. You can also find it uh, throughout the internet uh, available to rent or stream. If we look at our week seven file, here is a introduction to the film as well as, well as a brief PowerPoint breaking down some of the key things we're going to look at as we discuss the film. Please make sure you watch this before watching the film. Here are the links to the parts of the film, parts one, two, and three. Please note part three is uh, recorded via the Blackboard Collaborate site, so you don't see a video here. You will have to use this link here but the entire film is available for you to watch on Blackboard. It may not be the best quality, but it is there for you to watch and you can view it. After you've watched the film, I would look at all of the supplemental materials to help you understand the film Children of Men. Right. After viewing the film, you'll be able to do writing quiz five and discussion board number five. Real quick thing about discussion board post number five, as you look at it, all right, one of the things that I want you to talk about as you watch the opening scene of Children of Men is the material that's going on in the background. That means stuff that is essentially further away from the camera. So if it is up close or centered in the frame, like as you're watching it, if it looks bigger because it's closer to you, that is not what I want you to write about. I want to write about the things you see going on in the background of the scene, on the sides of the scene. So please don't write about the television uh, in this scene that is incorrect. Pay attention to the things that are farther away from the camera. Uh, for writing quiz number five, please make sure you've watched the movie all the way to the end, as I am only talking about the last scene of the movie, which is the scene with Theo and Key in the boat. All right? Anything before that is not the last scene in the movie. These two instructions will help you kind of understand and guide your writing. Right. Those are the two things that we need to do for this week. Uh, watch the film, watch the material on the film, and do writing quiz number five and discussion board quiz number five. I hope you have a great week and weekend and be safe out there.